start by opening it for so Now, I'm just going to mix this with the, um, I don't know what it's called, but I'm going to mix it up. Now, let me see how good it's mixing. All I see is blue and white and green. How about if I add more colors? I think I'll make it more cute. That's what I'm thinking. So I added some yellow, and now it's looking amazing. You can see by here, and it looks so cute, too. Now let me add one more color. That is a little bit of red. Everything in your life needs some red. 
Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Now let's just mix it all up until it's nice and mixed. Oh, I see a beautiful little rainbow in here. It's just so cute. I love it. Now let me add more into this one before I mix this one. Yellow. Everyone needs yellow in their life like the sun. Okay, now let's mix this one up. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Let's mix this all up. Oh yeah. Let me see. Oh, it's so blue now. Let me add some green into it, even if there's green on the bottom. Let me add some more green. Nobody can have enough green in their life, too. I'm missing one more color. It's blue. Let me add some blue. There it is. This is going to be a rainbow candle. Instead of uh, not just a mermaid sand candle, a mermaid one. Because I love mermaids. Okay, let's mix this one up. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Let me show you how mine turned out. Now we're going to add our seashells. I like this one, so let me put my, this one in. Ooh, it's so cute. Hey, actually, I think I, we are supposed to put that in there because there's a little hole in it then. Well, we stick it in the candle, but I don't think that's meant it for it. So let me just keep on putting, adding shells. Ooh, look at all these pretty ones. Look, a purple shell. Ooh, blue shell. The blue shells? I never see one. Oh, a purple one. This is so cute. I think I'll put my mermaid somewhere around there. <gasps> this is beautiful. Oh, this one's even cuter. Let me add this one right there. Now, a dark blue one right here. I mean, I mean right here. So now, let's add this one. Ooh, yeah. This shell's really weird and creepy, but it still looks kind of cute. I can use it. Kind of reminds me of a clam a little. And now, let's add a little more decorations to this one. Oopsie daisy. It's okay if you make mistakes because everyone makes mistakes. Even mommy and daddy make mistakes. So now that's finished. Let me read the rest of the instructions. Number six. I mean, number seven. When you're happy with your sand design, get a bottle of water and funnel. Hold the funnel, close the sand and shells, then carefully pour the water slowly to the funnel. Cover the sand with water. The sand will slowly get wet and heavy. So I got some water here. And now I'm nervous about this one. Now. Ooh. Like a little. Now let's let, add some water into this one. Not too much. I don't want it to overflow and make a mess. That's enough. Now. We're going to, when you're, let me read it. instruction number eight. When it's time to open the bottle of the candle oil, carefully pour the candle oil on the top of the water. The oil will stay on the surface and make you cover the whole surface with an oil layer. Let's see. Hey, nothing's coming out. I finally figured out how to open this, so now let's pour some. Ooh, wow. Okay. Ooh, wow. It's so googly. Now let's add, okay, now let's add some in here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's add a little more. I accidentally emptied out everything in there, but it's okay. Everyone makes mistakes. Okay. 
Okay, so that's it now. I'm just going to mix this up right there. Now we're going to add the stick into it. Let me stick it all the way to the bottom so it's not too hot. Okay, like that. Now we're going to add this one in. Okay. The candles are almost ready. Now let me read the instructions. Warning, supervision required. Before lighting the candle, make sure there's enough sand me surrounding the candle. Use your fingers to firmly press the sand surrounding the candle. Although supervision required before, I mean, okay, now let's do this. So now, we're just... Let's light this, but I have to ask Mommy to help, and she's recording right now. Mommy, can you help me light the candles? Thank you. Now she's around to light the candles. Now I think I'm gonna add the mermaid. Mom, let me read. It's so cute. Now let me read the instructions to see if I add the mermaid. Adult supervision required. Before lighting the candle, make sure there's a, an adult present and ask the adult to light the candle. But lighting, keep away from paper or any other flammable materials. Now I think we add a mermaids. Ooh, that's really hot around there. So be careful. Okay, now our mermaid's sinking in the water. Now let's add our other mermaid. That's for my little sister. Oof. Oof. Mommy, can you help me do this? Because it's a little smaller and hotter. Now, we are all done. That's how to make a... A dye mermaid, I mean a DIY mermaid water candle. Have a great day, guys, and be careful with fire. Bye! And make sure you like and subscribe, and you don't have to do the same design as me. You can do your own design, and you can use the di different kinds of shelves. Like, if you get some from the beach, you could put them in here. And you don't have to make yours the same as mine if you don't have to, want to. But you can do your own design and be creative. And like and subscribe and tell us if you like this video in the comments below. Have a great day and be safe from fire. Bye! Have a great day, everyone, and I hope you enjoy our video. And just enjoy the little cute little mermaids we have. So that one is the big jar, this one. This one is. And I hope you like our candles as well. And I hope you do this a good job and believe in yourself when you make mistakes. Bye!